Hello, hello. I'm back for Star Rail. Last time around we did Star Rail, we began with the Wardens and also finished up like the story part around Fate Show and actually had like a incredibly cool boss fight, not gonna lie. And potentially you wanna finish up the wardens today that you went for it. My so hallucinations are getting worse. When I was fighting Topaz, do you know who I saw? Kokolia, I think it was. I saw Madame Kokolia standing at the other end of the ring, summoning blades of ice aimed at me. So, I don't think this is just some simple culture shock issue. It just doesn't sound like a culture shock issue, to be honest. I'm not sure what's wrong with him, actually. Oh, I know! It's gotta be some IPC baddie dressed up as the Supreme Guardian, so you would hesitate to attack Topaz! How could he replicate it? There's a break coming though. up, so there won't be any fights. Luca, you can use this chance to rest and recuperate. I do need a break. I'm not actually an Iron Man or anything. Speaking of which, Pitch Star Cook the Great, what are you doing here on your own? Where'd Svarog go? <laughs> Svarog said he needed to do some data sampling. He asked Hook to wait for him here and not disturb Luca. Hook has been a goodie and waiting here alone. Data sampling? <sighs> Forget it. It's not something I should be worrying about. Coach, I think I need to get my symptoms looked at. But where can I see a doctor on the Shinzo? Ah, yeah, let's go to our community mission. Commission, we definitely know people there who Please, gonna... if you don't mind. Oh, I hope they're as good as Natasha. Oh, even better, probably. Links, all right. Tao, please help me out. Did you take a look at the, the divination commission? I don't think he knows the way. Uh, why message me? I'm already he's competing at the moment. I don't want to interrupt him. Let's have a message for you. It's about Igor. The Divination Commission said uh, the Jade Pendant we brought them is actually a Jade Abacus. We should know what it is. It contains Igor's records. I think Igor would definitely be interested. I wait for you at the Divination Commission. Since when is Lynx here? What does the Divination Commission do again? A simple explanation would be that they are the Information Technology Department on the Sienjo. They are mainly responsible for predicting the future. Predicting the future? I guess they're kind of a big deal. At first I thought she was a little awkward, but I guess she just uh, doesn't like socializing. Who? What should we do first? See a doctor or go to the divination commission. Uh, I agree. If the hallucinations are getting bad, we should see a doctor sooner rather than later. I want to go too. I want to go too. What did Sparog say? Pitch Dark Hook the Great isn't allowed to disturb Luca. But this lounge is so small and boring. I can't show off my moves in a tiny place like this. <laughs> then, Pitch Dark Hook the Great, shall I take you to our room alley to eat yummy food? Have you ever eaten a song lotus cake that chirps? I've never eaten it before. What's that? If I can taste this sun blotter's cake, I'll... Uh, I'll make you the mole's grand captain of gourmet discovery! Thank you, Pitch Dark Hook the Great. Let's set off right now. <laughs> All right. Uh, Miss Carmella is such a kind person. She could get along with Hook so quickly. Okay, Coach. We should get going, too. All right. Uh, can I actually, like, uh... No, that's not it. Uh... Can I actually follow the 
Event story mission. Thank you. Navigate. Whoa. This is the Alchemy Commission? This whole place is a hospital? Oh, can it get any bigger than this? <laughs> oh, Sushang is also here alongside Lingxia. Wow, cutting edge medicine. You must really be something to bring me straight here to get treated. Up you, Patrice, should do the trick. No, oh, isn't that Miss Sushang? What's she doing here? Good question. Miss Sushang, what a coincidence! I guess you have a problem too? What sort of greeting is that? You're the one with the problem. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I mean, are you here to see a doctor too? No, I came here to help my Cloud Knight co-workers get medication for their bruises and swelling. Uh, sorry, I went too hard on him. It was a fair match, so no one's to blame. Actually, we should be grateful to you. They were so impressed by your abilities that they said they wanted to train harder. All right. <laughs> we meet again. Who is this beside you? Mm, I you beat up the guy Cloud Knight. Hello, yeah. I'm Luca, a friend of his. I'm from Bellabog and a contestant in the current war dance. Bellabog. Apologies, I'm not familiar with the name. Regardless, welcome to the law room, Mr. Luca. Are you here for a consultation? Uh, this might sound weird. Look at it, it's hallucination. Interesting. Hmm. Let's run an imaging test first to confirm that your brain has no organic issues. A fighter's bound to run into such problems. Huh? What's it got to do with anything organic? I thought mechanical parts were fine in the tournament. Uh, not that organic. It means... Uh, oh, how do I explain this? It means that the brain is broken. <laughs> huh? Simple enough. The brain is broken? Uh, don't worry. Now that you're at the Alchemy Commission, I'll do my best to find a solution. Hold still and don't move. Three, two, one. Cheese! <laughs> we are not taking a photo. <laughs> hmm. Cauldron Master, what do you see? Is there any hope for me? Uh. Hmm. <laughs> There's a huge shadow in his brain. Could it be? <laughs> I'm too young to die, Doc. Come on, don't go through like all of the cliche phrases. I'll do it. I'll stay positive and defeat the demons of this illness. Uh, that shadow looks a lot like my hand. <laughs> You are still making the V sign. I told you it's not a photo. From the exam results, it looks like there's nothing wrong with your brain. Mr. Luca, have you been eating anything unusual lately? Let me think. I ate some of the local delights when I got here. Song lotus cake, chili oil beef opal stew, scale gourd spring water, mung bean soda, spicy diced chicken, garlic infused pork. After the tournament officially started, my diet has been pretty much the same. Brown rice, corn, buckwheat, boiled chicken breast, boiled beef shank, poached fish, boiled prawns. Uh, are we eating livestock here? Mr. Luca, don't be afraid to tell me. Is he mistreating you? I will make sure you get justice. <laughs> <laughs> of course not. I have to watch what I eat during a match. I can't be stuffing myself with junk. Your appetite <laughs> astounds me, but it seems you didn't eat anything that might affect your brain. Oh, right. After the match with Miss Sushang, I drank a bottle of Sweet Dream Soda. But I think I was already hallucinating before that. Sweet Dream Soda. I think I understand what's going on. 
It's not unusual to be anxious when you're far away from home. When your nerves were thrown into disarray, the sweet dream soda you drank intensified it. That drink has a fair amount of memoria in it, intended to make dreams more vivid and pleasant. But instead, it caused your anxiety to be amplified, eventually triggering serious hallucinations. Huh. Interesting. Sorry, I didn't understand a word you just said. It's I did, though. There's no cure for such a symptom. What I mean is that you don't require medication. Just stroll around the Lafu more and take in the barrage of new sights and sounds. Stop drinking Sweet Dream Soda and your symptoms will disappear in a few days. Stroll around the Lafu more. Don't drink Sweet Dream Soda. Okay, I've got it memorized. Got it memorized. <laughs> Doesn't know this crow that all you people. I'm suddenly reminded of something that might help alleviate your symptoms. Please wait a moment. Something that can help alleviate my symptoms. And that's. Also, why is it cutting the cutscenes when it's just me like pushing another button at the same position where it just was now? Lady Lingsha said that these medical patches are very effective, but we're fighting again tomorrow. Will it be enough? Nope. You guys didn't know? The war dance has a popularity revival rule. If eliminated contenders or teams garner enough popularity votes in online polls, they can participate in the repechage and re-enter the ring. Oh, interesting. So, Miss Susong's team is really popular then. <laughs> it's all mainly thanks to my good friend, Little Gwei. All she has to do is tap a finger on the internet and our popularity votes will blast through the roof like a comet. Yeah, she, I think she means more like a rocket. You know what I mean. <laughs> anyway, it's all thanks to Lil Gui's hard work that I, Su Shang, am back in the fight. <laughs> Not bad at all. A uh, friend that you can rely on is the most blissful thing in the world. Mr. Luca, come take a look. This is the tusk for treatment that I've prepared for you. What the hell is this? Whoa, what is it? Uh, touch it, touch it. Yeah. Oh, it's too cute. Oh, you're just like a strawberry bun. Oh, sweetie. <laughs> so I was going way too overboard here. <laughs> Never. I can't stay rational in the face of such cuteness. <laughs> this is a tusker of the Sienjo Juming. Warm, sweet, not for consumption. I like how she oh, needs some stress to not. But how can it make me better? The tusk purr is a creature that subsists on memoria. Hugging it while you fall asleep can raise your sleep quality, treat insomnia, and relieve anxiety and depression. So literally it's just like a helpful sleep and a cuddle buddy. Fair enough. And the tusk purr loves strong memoria. The more depressed you are, the more happy it'll be. Isn't that right, little fella? Okay. <laughs> I think we could need that IRL. <laughs> Sounds great. Uh, how much? <sighs> Don't worry. This Tusker is a personal pet of mine. I can lend it to you for this treatment, but you have to take good care of it for me. Oh, I can't thank you enough. All throughout my journey, I've received so much help from the Alliance. I will definitely repay everyone. Oh, oh, you two! You guys have something important to attend to later, right? It must be awfully tiring lugging this cutie pie around, right? 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 Don't try to eat it, Zushan. What? Can't I touch it just a little? <laughs> Go take care of your stuff. I'm about to head back to the Sky Splitter to deliver some meds to the team. As a cloud knight, I always help out and do at least one good deed a day. I can take this tusk bird to the lounge for you. I'll just hold it for a bit. I swear her. I won't steal it. I doubt That's that. Fine by me, Miss Sushang. You can also come play with it anytime you want. Oh yeah! Thank you, Mr. Luca. Come here, cutie. <laughs> Adorable little tusky. You're so cute. I could just gobble you right up. 
Please do not. Thank you. So John holds the tusk in her arms. Oh, it's funny. She's acting just like Zila did the first time she saw a real plains bear. <laughs> and walks her way out of sight. All right. Looks like the tusk bear not only regenerates rationality, it also destroys it. <laughs> mm. Fair now enough. That make for an interesting research topic. If there's nothing else I can do for the both of you, I'll be on my way. Thank you for the tusk bear. I will treasure it and shower it with love. Oh, Did we you shower it with the alchemy commission? Hope we didn't keep links and the master diviner waiting too long. Like, if it gets heavy when it's because like. The breast memoria. Shouldn't you give it more like a lot of depression instead of kindness? Look, Lynx is over there. Quick, let's go see her. What's being One zero here? one. Luca, you're here. I had a strange encounter. I was at the plaza watching people play cards, and I met a kind-hearted girl. She said she could help us repair the jade abacus we brought. I always forget how her uh, name is pronounced, but I think I know who it is. But she was just called away by a few diviners and still hasn't returned. Yeah, isn't this girl a bit... much? Thank okay, you. we can get a break. You're a huge help. The girl should be just over there, playing some game with other diviners. <laughs> I definitely know who it is. President Ching, you're getting better and better. You're probably slacking off at work playing this game, right? Hey, you know, it's Ching, right? You're one to talk, setting up endless scenarios in the Divination Commission. So it is you, President Ching. Oh, I'm sorry. I was too engrossed playing. I didn't notice the time. <laughs> Isn't this the nameless? You're super popular in our circle. That's not the same. We Pathfinder fans definitely admire you more than others outside the circle. Okay. It's the Pathfinder fan circle. We heard that you relied solely on the Pathfinder to overcome the Heliobus possessing the Master Diviner. <laughs> That's definitely the highlight of the Pathfinder since its conception 300 years ago. I kind of forgot what all happened with like the he with like uh, Fushiren being possessed by Heliobus, but I. But our President Ching said it was all down to your hard work. Okay, he and I have some things to take care of. Play with you next time. No! You guys can't leave! Gosh, yes, you can. you scared me. What do you want? It's not every day we need a Pathfinder legend. We can't let you leave that easily. You have to play around a round of Pathfinder with me or I won't let you take President Ching away. Mm. <laughs> I don't want to see Shrink and ever. How many Ching Chuas do you have? Oh. <laughs> <sighs> Just play around with her. I doubt she'll let go of this chance to boast about it. Since I have her E6, does it count like of having a 7 of her? <laughs> Let's play around! What was the Pathfinder game again? You ready to have a match with me? Sure, lightning quick. Ah, I wrote that. It was that thing.
Is he? They don't call you a legend for nothing, Nameless. You solve my riddle in a flash. Pathfinder. Once you play, you'll forget about hatred, love, and life itself. In the Divination Commission, we play such a magnificent, bold, and fiery game. Satisfied now? Then we'll be off. We'll Just come find you tomorrow if we're free. Hold on! Recently, our Pathfinder Circle has also been organizing a major event, taking advantage of the momentum for the war dance. Not just for those in the Lafu. Many of our like-minded brethren on other Sienjo ships have also come. You may have seen our ad we put out in the papers. You should join if you're interested. If hey, you mind. join up, our first major event will be considered a wild success. Fantastic! Looking forward to it! <laughs> Who would have thought that you'd be so immensely popular in some weird circle? To be honest, I'm not that surprised. <laughs> I mean, the trailblazer, uh, yeah, the trailblazer is kind of a weirdo themselves, so yeah, I'm not surprised. Is this the friend that you mentioned, Luca? Pleased to finally meet you. I keep seeing you in the news. My name is Chingche, a diviner from the Divination Commission. Miss Lynx has told me everything. She also said she found some rare antique that she hopes I can fix. At first glance, I knew it was a Jade Abacus. And an old model from centuries ago, too. Out of curiosity, I accepted the job to restore the data inside it. <sighs> Nothing gets past you. You know that the Master Diviner has returned to the Yuche on business? Before she departed, she left me with a mountain of data, spreadsheets, and even more data and spreadsheets. <laughs> My eyes were seeing stars. Now that such an opportunity has fallen into my lap to restore an important historical document, strictly speaking, taking this job doesn't count as slacking off. And I might even get to unveil a fascinating tale. Why wouldn't I take the job? And I've actually already restored part of the information. But Link said that you have to be the first one to look at it, because the owner of this Jade Abacus is your idol. She's right. Thank you, Lynx. Let's play the recording, then. Trust me. With your skills, you'll surely make a name for yourself if you join the Interstellar Circuit. Prize money, fame, things others can't achieve in a lifetime, all within your reach. Of course I'd be thrilled to win, but what I truly hope for is that people will listen to my post-match speech. I know what you're thinking. I've heard about your home's plight. Honestly, many worlds have been attacked by Nanook's mad legion. So I must remind you, the audience paid good money to watch a thrilling show. They're not interested in your words of woe and weal. Igor, you sure are a miracle. For a competitor hailing from a frontier planet to get into the final at Pier Point, it's something only a handful have achieved. So cheer up a little. I'm just a plaything for their entertainment. Look at what I've had to do. Severing my perfectly good arm and replacing it with an IPC prosthetic. All to make the matches more dangerous and thrilling. <laughs> Whoa, okay. <sighs> if mom saw me in this state, she would be heartbroken. If your mother saw the prize money you won, she'd understand. Can my prize money buy me an army? If you want to buy a mercenary army outfitted with standard gear, you'd have to defend your champion's title at least 20 times and accept countless endorsements. Can you last that long? Can your home? Before the Antimatter Legion invaded, 
When he participated in all the fighting tournaments across the cosmos, he would address the audience with a speech after he won, hoping that would raise awareness about the Antimatter Legion and save his planet. He really was an extraordinary person. Alas, the cosmos is infinitely vast, easily drowning out one planet's meek cry for help. <sighs> Sorry. I shouldn't have spoken so flippantly about a fascinating tale earlier. No, come on. It's no need to it's right. we need to apologize. This already. is a chapter in history that's already happened anyway. Regardless, to be able to hear Igor's actual voice after seven centuries makes me more than happy. This section of information doesn't mention the Sienjo Alliance at all. I wonder how he fought his way to the Law Fu. Anyway, this is all the content that's been restored so far. I should be able to salvage some data, but I'll need a couple of days. Perhaps the subsequent data will be able to tell us why he arrived on the Sienjo. We'll contact you if there are any new findings. I'll stay at the Divination Commission for now. There are some other matters I have to handle besides restoring the Jade Abacus. Hmm. I'll try my best to restore the data in the Jade Abacus, but it'll take some time. All right, uh, you go back first. I'm gonna take a stroll along the streets. That doctor advised me to walk around the town and see more of the sights. If I can walk along the streets alone a few more times, I might be able to conquer my fear of the big city. This place scared the heck out of me when I first got here. After all, in the future, I'll have to be like Igor, competing all over the cosmos for Belabog. I can't keep getting spooked and hallucinating all the time. <laughs> it is a good learning experience for Middle-East. You can, you really can deny that. Oh, <sighs> I'm lost again. The streets in this big city all look the same. I just want to enjoy a cup of tea. Why is it so difficult? Isn't this a great opportunity to practice asking for directions? Let's ask this guy. Of course. Excuse me, little bro. Uh, I'm not sure how old you are. Can I call you little bro? Hmm? Are you talking to me? If you're not one of long life species, then I guess we're around the same age. Is there something you need? I'd like to ask, uh, how can I get to the sleepless Earl? Go straight until Starwatcher Avenue. Keep to the right, and you'll see a storyteller performing on your way. That's where the sleepless Earl is. Thanks, little bro. Really sorry for the trouble. It's my first time visiting another civilization. It's normal to feel a little uncomfortable when you're so far from home. If you need any help, just ask. So, where are you from? I'm from Bellabog. Oh, we've only recently re-established connections with the cosmos, so you might not have heard of it. Bellabog? I've heard of it from others. No wonder your metal arm looks so awesome. Master, you must be here to compete in the war dance, right? <laughs> Master? Ah, you flatter me. Uh, my name is Luca. I'm here to compete in the war dance. I hope to make a name for myself by successfully challenging the ringmaster of the Xianzhou Luo Fu, so that everyone will know the name Bellabog. Hmm. You Good luck with that. You want to challenge the ringmaster of the Luo Fu? You want to challenge Yan Qing? <laughs> it seems like our stars are aligned. <laughs> You're also here to compete in the war dance? Are you? Also here to challenge the one named Yan Qing? He is Yan Qing. <laughs> I guess, as a warrior, I always have to keep challenging myself. Yeah, I agree. Warriors have to keep challenging themselves and strong enemies. If you stop moving forward and get scared by the enemy in front of you, all past battles become meaningless. To be able to represent the Xianzhou Lo Fu. This Yen Qing must truly be a legendary fighter. 
<laughs> I'm not feeling so sure of myself now that I think about it. <laughs> Come on. I feel the same as you whenever I stand in the ring. Although I am confident in the skills that I've honed over the years through my hard work, honestly speaking, there's always that nagging uncertainty about how good my opponents might be. It's like fear sneaks in and messes with my confidence. That's what he does. <laughs> uh, I've got a little trick that can help you conquer your pre-match anxiety. Find an empty place and scream the name of your opponent until you truly believe that you can beat the enemy you fear. <laughs> what an interesting trick. Okay, I'll give it a go. I will be victorious. The last one standing in that ring can only be me. I, Luca, will definitely win. I will defeat Yin Ching. <laughs> <laughs> if you knew. Come on, let me hear you shout. Let's pump herself up. Uh, <laughs> me too. Come, shout with me. I will defeat Yan Ching! I will defeat Yan Ching! <laughs> you should have said Luca. Yan Ching won't defeat me! Yan Ching won't defeat me! <laughs> hey, you're right! All that shouting made me feel much more confident. And the JBZ behind him just got to walk in. Wasn't lying. Although I haven't seen much of the world, I do have a lot of experience fighting. I hope this helps. Thank you, Luca. It's late. I have to go prepare for my match. Oh, my friend, you haven't told me your name. <laughs> you can call me Lung Fung. <laughs> In the Xianzhou language, it means an icy blade. May fate bring us together again, Luca. <laughs> I was taking on a pseudonym for Luca. Interesting. Lung Feng. Now that's a really cool name for such a cool person. Is Luca back yet? Let's head back to the lounge and take a look. Oh, let's see. Such a little thing bursting with so, uh, such wonderful, wondrous ability. The adventure is certainly full of surprises. Does this has to do anything? It's more amazing than a horde. I hacked his touch pearl and took a nap just now. And in terms of I was fighting a battle that felt super real. It was against a giant cockroach three meters long. Okay. Could this castle be used for combat training? Really? Let me try. Hmm, maybe it's because I'm sick and that somehow I triggered that has a special trait. Maybe it doesn't work on you. I don't know. We should give it a shot. He also stares at you blankly, looking like it's about to doze off. One can experience hyper realistic buttocks in a dream just by hacking into silly. What kind of Panaconian daydream is this? <laughs> True. Call us when his arms are into the tree net. <laughs> pick up the tusker and sit on the floor and close your eyes. You're ready to experience this fable dreamscape combat training. A slight problem though. You're on sleep at all right now. And even if you are, you can't possibly go to sleep under eager gazes of your friend Luger, can you? Something's off. A sudden wave of drowsiness hits you. And your conscience starts drifting away. The Tusper sure is a wondrous creature. A warden streamscape training. To issue challenges against higher difficulty ring masters every time you pass a phase of mission. Ah, interesting. You are unable to obtain wipes through actions only by performing highlights to gain wipes in invisible states. Okay, they are just like. High difficulty. Okay. 
Achieve highlight during the matches to wipes. Inflict weakness, break, or defeat enemies. Uh, the action is immediately transferred forward. Okay. I mean, I could try this party up here if I'm, if I'm getting those. It should actually, yeah, it should actually be a, mm, quite a good team, actually. Then... Um, where are they? Jojo? Would have put him for support though. Mm. Yingxia, even though I haven't yeah, leveled her yet that much. Ah, oh, come on, we can use Yingxia. For active, sure, let's take the recommended ones. Using the toast. A little more heat. I'm honored since you're already here. Why not have a meal before? The <laughs> I weep for the departed. <sighs> it too shall fall. Since you're already here, why not have a meal before you come? I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Uh, then let's go like... This combat needs optimizing. <laughs> this is double speed. I'm honored by your since you're already here. Why not have a meal before you leave? The truth for everything in this world is bleeding. <laughs> you are doomed to fail. Again, back. I just noticed I haven't given Ling any relics also. The eternal breeze will bury you. Judgment of eternal winter. <laughs> He's using way too many actions. Again. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. You are doomed to fail. My back. Destined for oblivion. Yeah, I'm kind of stupid because I haven't given Lingja any word, I guess, yet. Um. I'm just gonna go for her. Refuse. 
using the toast? A little more heat. I'm honored, since you're already here. Why not have a meal before you leave? Time for a bun. <laughs> I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. On the still waters of oblivion. More season. <laughs> More enemies. Time for a bug. <laughs> This combat needs up. <laughs> this is double speed. Stay put. Uh, to here. Fiends or devils, I'll crush them all. I'm honored since you're already here. Why not have a meal before? <laughs> I weep for the departed. <laughs> It too shall fall. Mm -hmm. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. This combat needs optimize. <laughs> this is double speed. I'm honored by your since you're already here. Why not have a meal before you leave? Fiends or devils, I'll crush them all! Tremble before my power! How much is it gonna be spamming again? Again? Destined for oblivion. My back. Witness the avalanche! Judgment of eternal winter! Again. Spamming right about here. Yeah. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. I'm honored, since you're already here. Why not have a meal before you leave? Another journey begins. Still waters of oblivion. Can I have fun this time? Mm, I already attack. It's better to make no a little more heat. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. You are doomed to fail. Again. Destined for oblivion. Don't worry, it's just a the scream. The eternal breeze will bury you. Judgment of eternal winter. I don't like it that you can charge it and use it in the same round immediately. This combat needs up to... <laughs> this is double speed. Fiends or devils. I'm honored, but since you're already here, why not have a meal before you leave? I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. You are doomed to fail. I'm honored, since you're already here. Why not have a meal before you leave? Guess we're getting his web finally. Which shows you how much damage it does. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. We're not done. enough. All right.
This combat needs optimizing. Mm. <laughs> this is double speed. I'm honored, but since you're already here, why not have a meal before you leave? Thieves or devils? I'll crush them all! Again? Back. Freeze to death! Feel the freeze! <laughs> Good as new. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. A world devoured by ice. This will be your burial ground. Destiny for oblivion. Free will, or was it fate? Still waters of oblivion. More mm. season. I'm honored. Since you're already here, why not have a meal before you leave? I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Bam. For oblivion. Oops. What was my intention to stop that, but a good. Get them! Fiends or devils! I'll crush them all! Freeze to death! Feel the freeze! This combat needs optimum. <laughs> this is double speed. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Another journey begins. On the still waters of oblivion. Stop swearing I'm honored, you since you're already there. here. Come on. Why not have a meal before you leave? Devoured by ice. This will be your very <laughs> ground. Uh... I've got a raid to get to. Good. Let's finish this. I weep for the departure. Yes, it too shall fall. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Sweet. Gotta go to Scarlet, this. Instant just now. Also, did you get to see any hybrid sick battles? <laughs> this is breaking the battle portals for Panic County. Okay, the name of this place looks like you have to go visit it too. Who <laughs> <laughs> can definitely use this uh, cure uh, task here to complete some danger zone training? As a Judoka, even you can use this at all world, but now I'm created to simulate really challenging combat scenarios while dreaming. The Desperate is an exceptional ancient animal that loves helping humans out. Alright. Let me just like check what's recommended for lingerie in terms of set. Mm hmm. A going healing boost, speed attack of energy, energy regeneration. Fair enough. Fair enough. You should give Lingja some relics. Well, 
She has no recommendations yet, right? Yeah, there's no relevant statistics. Okay. Then... Give me... Where is it? There. And... There. Confirm. Let's see. Wanna like... I should actually will check for myself what does she scale with. This one I find at the same time with such performance actions advances. There are action advances. Follow up. <laughs> As the units are taken are going up an amount of break effect, alright. Is she okay, she's getting with break effect really. Break effect speed attack. Okay, you just really wanna have a speedy healing, break effective, and then attacking. Okay. Then I know my priorities. And probably this one. Yep. Um. Providing healing boost. Let's be sorted by outgoing. Rather, actually, don't, don't think I'm too. Attack, attack, speed. Attack, speed of Hectorus. Maybe effect resistance also wouldn't be so bad on her. I could not take it. Yeah, come on, better than nothing. Um, there's fire percentage, fire boost, attack HP. Do you go with this? No, definitely break effect. Turning a break effect with some kind of speed. Yeah. Attack rate, HP. Hey, you're gonna be improving this. There you go.
But potentially, I'm gonna do it like this so she can actually be more usable. Uh, yep. Okay, did we have, did we have another effect, um, outgoing heme helmet? Switch. Yes. We want some of favorite stats crows for us. Yeah, uh, it's a bit more favorable. Um... Metro photo, though, but nah, yeah, don't advertise stuff like that. Good. Uh. Okay, somewhat okay. We don't have much more. All right. At least it should be usable with that. <laughs> Go, tactics bro. We're gonna continue. What or who can we fight next? Ooh. Wootail. Okay. Where? Who said Eidolon for? Oh, it's Marcus Eidolon. News. We already watched it. Tactics. All right. Hmm. I mean, you gotta do. Oh, geez, anyway. Alright, some guest contestants competitions. Okay, come on, can you change the challenge? Actually, um, enemy trotters to gain a amount of wipes. Condition is refreshed, I'm sure, to by Alice. Basic attack increases by 50%. Okay. Hmm? Hmm? Sure, that's definitely a good lineup. I think I'm gonna pick Prono. Yeah, not really. We don't have like one. Yeah, no. Let's let's go with Tignion. And 
support. Who's gonna support? You're gonna support, I guess. This will be like a really a hyper carry team. Uh I'm gonna go with this actually. I'm getting more than enough energy out of this party. Once the ball gets rolling here, it looks quite nicely. Awaken dormant scales. World cleansing dragon. <laughs> I sense a storm. Heaven search. There's a giant one. Okay. Cleansing dragon. <laughs> a thousand one. Fight as one. Don't come again. Fiends or devils. I'll crush them all. Let's pull. Can you find the answer? Easy enough. Yeah, I think you want to do like all just to get the points. Juju and Epistle will be fighting on the Shusha Ranch martial arts. It's just another fight, so we're just gonna skip through it. Um, come. Oh, 
Oh, Tobras. Good to see you again, Luga. Time I'm more. Hello, Miss Tobras. In real acquainted, I had formally expressed my intention to collaborate with you the committee. The Swedish investment department would like to hire Luca as our brand ambassador, working closely with him across our entire product line. This role will boast Luca's visibility. Luca Swanger could become a name feature on billboards for the cosmos. The Bella work as the hometown of a superstar would certainly attract more development opportunities. This endorsement benefits both Bellaborg and the IPC. Mr. IPC really that generous. Well, the IPC isn't exactly generous, and I'm certainly not running a charity. It's really a mutual beneficial business deal, nothing more. Take a moment to think it's over, if that's okay. Take all the time you need. This invitation is offered in a spirit of mutual benefit and goodwill. I hope we can set aside your previous impressions of the IPC and build a deeper trust for this collaboration. I'm sorry, but I have to decline your generous aura. Your trust appears to be, uh, be precious, and you're not willing to give it away to the IPC lightly. No, Mr. Tobras, I deeply trust your intentions. I've clashed against you before, I can completely say you're trustworthy. But my initial reason for competing was to showcase Bellabog to the entire universe. Partnering with the IPC might make me doubt the purity of my actions. I trust Mr. Tobras' um, intentions. I'm not sure if Bellabog is ready to accept the IPC's offer, or how we should accept that offer. I can't make a decision right now. Thank you for your honesty, Luca. If you change your mind, feel free to let me know anytime. Oh, by the way, I heard you accepted the challenge from the fighter Shojin. Referring to the immature individual match, why bring this up all of a sudden? Just ahead of someone observer, be careful, that guy has plenty of dirty tricks. Thank you for the heads up. Alright. Okay. Oh, Google Mises is the Antona in secret. His secret thunder exposed. Ah! Oh. A good citizen. Oops. A, go uh, a good citizen accidentally filmed the uh, Luminary Ward and Star contestants. Lucas Strongmar was secretly meeting Topaz, a high level executive of the. IPC, Strategic Investment Department in Oro Melee. Experts suspect that the IPC shows of goodwill to Luca this time is yet another trap for them to deal with the Eurydice 6 problem. Huh. Is taking IPC's money, hero or hypocrite? Will of Sports Star exposes IPC lucky. Idiots. Hmm. All right. Okay, if this is expecting this to do the trick, the, to be doing the trick that was mentioned. Bam, bam, bam. I don't know the sky spell is deck, alright. Okay, the toilet card in the cyber room now. I think it was going on. Did <laughs> Hallucination is going bad right now.
I hope for an end to strife oh. in the world. Harmony and unison. Fangs and claws got dull. The fearless knows not fear. Venture forth to hunt forever. Triumphant! Ch 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 Victory is inevitable! Show okay, me what you can do. I'll give you five seconds. Never hesitate! Jump! The punches decide. May Song bring us victory. <laughs> Let the valuation begin. <laughs> Fangs and claws got dull. The fearless knows not fear. Too slow. <laughs> and I. How <laughs> we deal with that now at least? Don't know guy, you are here. It's been effort to you. Thank you, it's been both blood. Okay, strong resonation. Instance burner, she's a room of therapy. Now. Okay, we was usually was starting soon. I thought I'd come by, okay. Can just so divide. Okay, I'm doing the matches. I can revive. So we pick this pick on the boss. Okay, massive amount of vibes. Uh, when breaking every target, we can see all weakness break effects from all weakness and then we will have them. Okay. Oh wait, this is Luca Solo fight again. Okay. Get this stuff out of the way now. Just getting started. Yeah. Small fry. Step out of it. Where's the applause? Let's see some sparks fly.
God, don't annoy me this much with unvoiced stuff. Where's the applause? Let's see some sparks fly. The applause. Let's see some sparks fly. Go down, Blaze. You know them. I need to watch out. Uh, watch out when Sushang. Cyprus is going way long, way longer than a part of it would be. Vessel we will make an official appearance in this product launch, repair shop at event, but not as the ambassador would despair. Ah. Just wrap this up. We just haven't even used the training spit portion, so we'll go. Yeah, let's solve this one.
Sub targeting is a mod. Okay, we were waiting for uh, inflict weakness break or the video is a cease platform. Okay. Well, for your phone finding, it's okay. It's okay. Okay. Yep, this screams for a firefly party. Um, where's my firefly? There it is. Uh, and we're gonna be pulling in Ling Zhan. If I can find her. There. This is more than a battle set to the seas of play. Take your positions. Be a pure body and mind. Still the same. The mood is set. Let the show begin. Stay in step. Fight to what I will claim victory for my <laughs> Every petal all will be swept away by the wind. <laughs> May the foul stench dissipate quickly. Yeah. Truth, everything in this world is bleeding. Firefly takes sense to the sea of flame. Nice. Oh, here's a conclusion of this. I like my arrangement, Luca. What am I supposed to do? Uh, please inform me about arrangements at the next time. <laughs> okay, the children spice the IPC to the core. How could you fall for it and agree to your cooperation offer? I shouldn't really hate the IPC. I think perhaps not. Weapon advertisement? What do we mean? I'm currently the leading voice in the law who opposing IPC's capital intervention in the Zientro martial arts. The strategic investment department is here at the board and it's not for them to uh, match rankings. Look at as much as an opportunity to gain more business benefits our goal, Mr. Shujin. Don't you feel the same? But be like us, morality perspective, and the leaders are just pretenses for others. Don't think that much is countless credits, isn't it? I think your mere endorsement deal can sway me. I've dominated the fighting scene for years. Do you think I'm that desperate for money? Besides, I've heard you were originally aiming to sign Luca as your spokesperson. Unfortunately, it's not a very opportunistic young man. He fulfills my proposal. If someone refuses to win, win, someone else accepts. That's why I found you. Next time, we'll organize a duel under the guise of a new product launch where you and Luca will compete. 
I really like the latest IBC armor for you with your skills plus the IBC's newly developed next. Are you afraid of a one-armed boxer? Is IBC armor is what you want me to endorse? Bingo. Think about how beneficial this endorsement could be for you. The video you in public and being chosen by the IBC as the exclusive face of this end show. Here's this billboard. Your face will be on it and everyone in the loaf will know you. A face on a billboard. In that case, I have one more request. I want to be... The Commissioner for the Central Strategic Investment Part uh, Department Operations. Visi welcomes new faces from different cultures and backgrounds. Ready that you be look at tomorrow's launch. Has the main we children or uh, your company's max? It seems you have an additional agreement. We're doing business with Tobias. Oh, considering we've always uh, emphasized the use of traditional central martial arts, wouldn't that conflict conceptually with IBC's Max products? I rarely see any ancient martial arts. Uh, Include this comprehensive, even if you handed me a blast gun, I could integrate it as one of the traditional martial arts of the central. Such a large build up with my face on it. I just the thought of it is rolling. After hundreds of years, I finally made it. But that's what it is all about. Now it's truly all you want. You should say that. Alright. I think we can skip the preamble. Uh, yeah. The bro sample. It doesn't even give me points for uh, the pies, it's just extra. Ah. Okay. Weakness prone enemies can also have a lot of lives. Weakness break. Taking time and looking at the for a to make stun stacks. Okay. A lot of physical and fire weakness. Uh, I don't have a Buddha build and I don't want to use a try run. Also, I feel like this also could work quite well for him. Uh, bam, Lingsha, 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 there you go. Take your positions. Be of your body and mind. My oath is to us. The beauty is eternal. I will protect all beauty. For a um. The mood is set. Let the show begin. Grace. Yeah. Every petal, all will be swept away by the wind. Allow me to purge the root of the yeah. The truth. Everything in this world is bleeding. Time to cleanse the filth. Ooh, nice. Uh, bam, 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 bam. The mood is set. Let the show begin. Every petal, all will be swept away by the wind. The truth. Everything in this world is bleeding. Till I, I will protect all beauty. And Oh, actually, it's worthless. 
Oh, actually, yeah, they have a sick face. <coughs> Forget about that. My guiding light. I've already sort of saved the one team I've done. There's more to life. <laughs> Stay in step. Dreams do come true. <laughs> Grace and elegance. Yeah. <laughs> Be of your body and mind. My oath is to a solitary road. The beauty is eternal. I will protect all beauty. Grace and elegance. Existence is unity. Take your positions. Let's improvise. The mood is set. Let the show begin! My guiding light. Wretched and fleeting. Nice. Mood is set. Let the show begin. Every petal, all will be swept away by the wind. The truth. Everything in this world is bleeding. Till I, I will protect all beauty. For a driller. Oh. Not at all. After fighting in so many knockout stages, I think our points should be enough. Time to head to the Sky Splitter's leaderboard to confirm her ranking. Let's give Buddha a run for his money. I would say. Petition, but... I've got enough points. How about it, coach? Let's get ready to challenge some powerful opponents. Okay. Time to get fired up. Let's head back to the lounge. Mm -hmm. Luca, your next opponent is Boot Hill. You have to be careful. He's a dangerous maniac. <laughs> Come on. Right. Mm, indeed. By the looks of his photo, he really looks like a formidable character. I heard he's a galaxy ranger. What type of organization is that? The galaxy rangers are a diverse group of individualistic warriors that are disciples of the hunt. Some are pretty easygoing, but there's also bloodthirsty wanted criminals. Like... Boot Hill. <laughs> He's not that hunt. bad. So, isn't he the same as Xianzhou folks? No matter how dangerous he is, he won't be causing trouble in the land of his fellow disciples, right? Maybe. He's a really decent guy, yeah. Would a decent guy be on the IPC's wanted list? I don't think so. You just have to be cautious, Luca. A wanted criminal on the IPC's list is really no joke. I usually could imagine there would be some decent guys among the people on the list there because it just could be people the IPC just isn't cool with. And it might be just like a big difference in interests. <laughs> What's there to be afraid of? Uh, when I was defending the underworld with my master, I also met many hardened criminals. I even personally apprehended the Dark Widower of Boulder Town with my own two hands. Yeah, that's not the same though. Uh, I wouldn't compare Buta to some weird guy in the night streets. Boot hell. A fugitive wanted by the IPC. 
I'd hate to say it in front of Miss Carmella, but I have a feeling this wanted criminal might not actually be such a bad guy. After all, the Sienjo Alliance didn't arrest him, and they even allowed him to participate in the war dance. Of course, I'm not afraid of criminals. My iron fist is made to punish bad guys. Luca, are you ready to go up against Boo Hill? Definitely. It's time to go see what this criminal the IPC wants so bad is made of. Be careful. All right. Defeat enemy summons. Take more dot. Apply special canning to the enemy. Wasn't the enemy went off three times. Okay, this is a dot party. Um. Yep. I already see a recommendation there for a party which I definitely want to use. And oh yeah, you can go pure dots actually. Then let's go, Jada. Have you can to the boss and to your enemy and then you can win dots three times. It has a chance to receive a special match mix. Uh, do I want to choose? Oh, no. Probably DPS is better. Wait. Where are we dot? Oh, yeah, okay, come. Let's go with Jar Jar Abdul. battle in the blue corner the highly anticipated boxing champion from Bellabog, Luca Straga fighting out of the red corner it's none other than the notorious felon wanted by the IPC the galaxy ring major boot hill go for it Luca beat boot hill and hand him over to me we'll split the bounty in half <laughs> you little budget. I'll have you stewing in a pot sooner or later. Butter my fudge and call me a biscuit. Can't believe I'm seeing you here, brother. You competing too. Ah, uh, no wonder I didn't see your name on the list. I thought you were gonna fudge and ambush me here. <laughs> you guys are close? Yeah. Oh, we ain't exactly you could say so. the best buddies. Our lives were just raveled in the tangles of destiny. That don't mean I'll be showing any mercy. <laughs> I won't either. Let me give you some real advice, kid. Drop out now. You ain't in my league. The match hasn't started. How do you know I can't defeat you? My fist might not be slower than your bullet. <laughs> Diggity wubba boo! Cause we ain't on the same path, partner. You're here to win. I'm here for payback. You want honor, but honor ain't worth squat to me. Also, quit yapping about your fork and iron fist. That IPC sponsored piece of trash makes me sick. <laughs> I'll get a proper overhaul for you later. I want to see every news outlet in the cosmos buzzing with the headline. The IPC like stole the spotlight at the war dance. He came out with a fudge blazing and sure made them IPC shirt bags choke on the humble pie. I could actually like Buddha, uh, could actually imagine Buddha having a uh, uh, better technology for prosthetic arms like that, especially for fighting. Mr. Boothill, I don't know what kind of grudge you hold against the IPC, but I don't think we're too different. We both want the whole cosmos' eyes on us. All right, all right, I ain't gonna argue with you. 
If you want my bullets that bad, who am I to refuse, right? <laughs> well, before I came here, I drew six lucky wheels at the looking bronze in front of the Rainbow Arbiter. Tell you what, if my next six shots jam, you win. But if they don't, well, this ring's floor's gonna be a real mess, ain't it? Uh, Mr. Boothill, we're just sparring, that's all. Let's not risk our lives. Jack gum, wubba boo! Others might play games with you, but I ain't playing. I'm putting my life on the line here. But if you don't even have the guts to do the same, then what are you here for? <laughs> I... Come on, Come Buddha. On. Look down the barrel of my gun. Walk over here and take a swing at me. You got the guts. I'm speaking to Luca. Let him answer me. Luca, come on. Get over here and take a swing at me. You got the guts. Uh, speak up. Bring it on, Boot Hill. I'll make you eat your own words. <laughs> Screw up a boo. You got some guts. Bullets don't have eyes, so. Don't blame me for being ruthless. Huh. No, my hallucinations are getting worse. Man, why are you fighting this thing? Run away now, Luca. Don't go over there. You'll die. No, I... I can't. Two contestants have moved a muscle. Face each other on opposite side Edge of the ring. Since you're already here, why not have a meal before you leave? Stay put. Get there. Relax. Hi. Oh, don't even have the courage to step closer. Just what will Luca do in the face of Blue Hill's muscle? Fiends or devils? I'll crush them all! Good times. Time to say bye. Boom. Destiny isn't chosen. Uh, stand still. <laughs> Memories of beneath the waters lies an endless abyss. Lucas, snap out of it! A little more heat. Sorry, you shouldn't be fighting him, Luca. He'll kill you. I can't die here. I don't want to die. I don't want to die yet. I can already consider as dead when he's laying here, but okay. Destiny's hand has truly blessed me. No. I won't back down. If you're already here. Why not have a meal before you leave? Memories of beneath the waters lies an endless abyss. Good times. Time to say bye. Boom. Say this one last time. I had to turn around and leave. Get over here and hit me. Luca, bullets don't have Do you really want to die? No action yet from either side. The spectators are on the edge of their seats, their nerves on the brink of snapping. It's really like fighting his own in a demon thing. I'm honored, since you're already here. Why not have a meal before you leave? Good times. Time to say bye. Boom. Wow. 
Why is he always picking up the wolf? Just turn around and leave. leave. Nothing will happen. Run. Run. No. He won't back down. Ill tidings manifest. Attribution will find you. Fiends or devils, I'll crush them all. Good times. Time to say bye. Boom. Boom. You're already here. Why not have a meal before you leave? Fiends or devils, I'll crush them all. This is a thing. Let's see my talk. Uh, make no move. A little more heat. It's just a twin of the Good times. Time to say bye. Boom. Boom. I'm honored by your since you're already here. Why not have a meal before you leave? I'm honored since you're already here. Why not have a meal before you leave? Good time. Time to say bye. Boom. Fiends or devils. I'll crush them all. Luca, get it together. Stand still. Dead or indeed. Gone. What's going on? Am I dead? <laughs> Victor is Galaxy Ranger Boot Hill? Can be saved. So that's a good thing. <laughs> Poor Oak.
<laughs> We're getting a new news article. Strong loses to Silver Gun. Who has path to the Warlands meets first defeat. After the match began, the two contestants spent a long time confronting each other. A that was order. Contestant Luca Rod and charged at his opponent. Contestant Puto swiftly took out his weapon and fired six shots in rapid succession, instantly failing contestant Luca. Who not only won but also set a record for the fastest knockout in this war dance. I said peace cooperation issue is still in process amid ongoing turmoil. Luca defeats Rise's well, question was the war dance rigged. Luca's condition is worrying. Let's go see him at the lounge. Mm, it's always doing good. But he will. Luca really went way overboard. If it weren't for Luca's iron arm, L Luca would have been. <sighs> would have been. <laughs> He's way out of my league. I swear, getting near him, I felt like. Was staring death in the face. Luca. Yeah, and he was right. I'm such a country bumpkin. I shouldn't have come here in the first place. I'm way out of my league. Don't give up. Do you remember? The war dance has a popularity revival mechanic. Now the entire cosmos loves you. They'll definitely revive you. We have to see about that. Popularity revival? Maybe they all just want to turn me into a laughing stock. They just want to see me get beat up again and escape with my tail between my legs. I bet some will work for that. Sorry, Mr. Depart, Miss Bronya. I, I'm just a useless piece of nothing. But. Sorry, I. I want to be alone for a while. Oh, ho, ho. Time of Mario Bussi? Uh, currently not. Right. I saw on the news that you're the coach of the Battlebog team. I will show you a review, Bussi. I can't believe you're free. <laughs> Mr. Tay wants to ask why you suddenly have time on your hands. <laughs> Luca was eliminated. Here's the rest of that. I'm sorry. I didn't know. Ah, you weren't on me this so. time. <laughs> now we made Ho Ho cry. Oh, come on. Tay is making a fuss about wanting to see you. Uh, Mr. Tay said he wasn't making a fuss, but he was. Where do we meet? Let me just guy splitter. We'll be there soon. Alright. Huo Huo and Tails seem to be on the sky splitter too. Let's look for them. Well, let me roll around with Tauglas just so we can maybe find some treasure dress. Don't spread it around. These are all insider secrets. Wait, I was supposed to get up there. Uh Yeah, I don't know. There are different cycles there, but we're just gonna follow this. There's also one of the keys. Yeah, let's do that. Um, it needs to, it was supposed to be filled out, alright? 
then we go from from there. You go from here to here to here. There's another one down right down here. All right. Um. Reset this. Uh. Yep, there we go. I like this puzzle a lot more than the DD. Didn't want it like these cubes that the four. Where's this leading me? I mean, I'm guessing I'm picking up some stuff along the way for this, but. Yeah, I'm back at this place. Which is not helping me. So be it. Huh? You can always start over again. Otherwise I'm lagging. Where does it want me to go? There. Okay. Attention the navigation is not working out good. recently in the shackling prison i had a hard time trying to leave i'm very happy to be seeing you again oh Ken, are you a mind reader or something <laughs> huh. i see that you're coaching a war dance contender how about training Huawa so she can join the war dance and fight against a few others isn't this much more effective at training one's bravery than watching horror flicks? Guess so. Huh? So that's what you were thinking about? No, 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 no. <laughs> One punch and I probably won't stop crying for ages. Please don't do this to me. So that kid you're training, uh, Luca or whatever his name is, he got beat anyway. Isn't this the Perfect opportunity to throw Huahua into the mix. Oh, right. Is Mr. Luca doing all right? The news said he couldn't even stand. Since Mr. Luca is really popular, he'll definitely clear the popularity revival vote in return. Please cheer him on. Uh, what cheering? You're just trying to change the subject, you timid brat. You don't want to fight in the war dance, do you? Huh? Why? You got beat senseless? 
Yes, has been all on tales about Lucas losing hallucination in this lack of fighting spirit. Just excuses, I bet. He's bowing out just because he got thrashed? Extra, extra! Brat even more cowardly than Hua discovered. Read all about it! <laughs> wow. Don't say that, Mr. Tail. It's probably really emotionally damaging to realize how huge the skill gap is between you and your opponent. Is that the reason you don't want to fight? <sighs> If that kid wants to forfeit the match, coach, why don't you give Hua, Hua some proper training and forget about this mess? Actually, hallucinations. There's a way to deal with them, as long as there's someone who's superb at dealing with matters of the heart and a kind-hearted Heliobus willing to help out. <laughs> no wing, dude. I'm ending up joining her in the good ring. What are you lot looking at me for? <laughs> Stop looking at me like that! Do I look like a psychiatrist to you? Yeah. Sure, why not? Ah, you people! I bet you think I'm super useful, don't you? I'm charging a fee next time. Thank you, Mr. Tail. You wanna get smacked? <laughs> Where's Luca now? Take me to him. <laughs> take advantage of my post to watch the competition, but uh, I do have to walk to now. All right. Alright, I could have used these parcels there to actually warp to the other side, but okay. This is making me completely go run around around all of this. God, let me just teleport. You're back! Who are these two? Oh, Luca's fans! Luca, your fans are here to see you! Uh, uh, hang on! What's this? It's a ghost! Oh, oh, uh, to think Luca has fans from realms that transcend mortality! <laughs> Good thing I'm already used to such reactions. <laughs> Hello, Luca. I'm Hua Hua, and this here is Mr. Tail. We're your fans. Oh, my fans. Sorry to have disappointed you. <sighs> Luca's really down in the dumps now, and he can't lift his spirits up for anything. I ordered a couple pounds of grilled meat for him so he might have a feast to cheer him up, but he just sat there all moody and devoured the lot. At least he ate it. <laughs> At least his appetite hasn't changed. No matter how bad my mood is, high quality protein is never to blame. Actually, Mr. Luca, we're healers invited by Mr. Nameless to help you with your depressive emotions and hallucinations. There is no we. I'm the only one here who's powerful enough to perform such a difficult task. Everyone, I've already withdrawn from the tournament. Please stop wasting your time and money on someone as useless as me. Oh, I can't take it! The depression he's radiating is making even me uncomfortable. Ugh. Hurry up and let me at him. I'm really gonna start charging money next time. <laughs> uh, this Mr. Tail? What are you doing so close to me? <sighs> Cold! I was shivering for a second there.
All right. Where are we going to be seeing Lucas head? If we're to help the kid find his confidence again, we'll have to strike at the root of the problem and remove it completely. So annoying. Let's just make it quick. <laughs> Thank you, Psychiatrist Tail. <laughs> Margie! You're here to watch me fight again? Yeah! You're just too strong! I was so scared when those three big guys came out, but you managed to beat them all! I really hope I can grow up to be strong like Luca one day. Of course you will! You just have to eat well, sleep well, train well, and you'll be even stronger than I am. When that happens, you'll be able to KO me in just a few punches, and then yell triumphantly in the ring. The Multamerville Warrior, the peerless Balder Champion, defeater of evil throughout the world. <laughs> Not that, Luca. That's the line when you defeat the baddies. Uh, it's getting late. You should be getting home. The early bird gets the worm. That's how you grow up big and strong. Um, Luca? I might not be able to watch your next match. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's all right. Even if you're busy, I know you've always got my back. Just remember to come by for the match after that. I'm facing off against the decapitating singer, Congiorni, and you can't miss it. Luca, I don't think I can make it for that either. A long time after this, I might not be able to come. Uh, huh. What happened? I really hope I can grow up to be strong like Luca one day. Margie? Margie, where are you? Margie? Margie? Margie! Where did you go? Still haven't seen you grow up big and strong. Luca, who is that little girl? Her name's Margie. A fan of mine. She always came to watch all my matches. We got to know each other later and started chatting. But in the end, I still didn't really understand her situation. It wasn't until much later that I learned she had a serious illness and was battling for her life against it. <laughs> the underworld is impoverished, and the doctors tried their best, but they couldn't... they couldn't cure her. <sighs> My condolences, Luca. Uh, you may not be familiar with the place of my birth. When I was still a child, everyone led hard lives. Teetering on the brink of death at all times. Some died to monsters, others to bandits. I've seen so much death. Back then, I thought we were just too weak. If I could get just a little stronger, even just a little, we could vanquish our foes and keep on living. I did get stronger later on and became the boxing champion who trounced the entire underworld. At the time, I believed that as long as I swung my fists, no one could defeat me. I could be a role model for all the kids in the underworld. I could tell them that no matter how scary the opponent was, as long as we kept on fighting, we would win out. We would definitely win. But when I wanted to tell them, Margie, the news about my victory, her father told me she was gone. Margie, uh, she was battling the demons of her sickness. But that 
frail, tiny body of hers. She was always battling. She must win the next round. In the end, I finally understood that there are always unwinnable battles in life. Some fights, no matter how much you need to win, you still lose. Just like I faced off against Mr. Boot Hill. I lied to those kids and to myself. I can't face them. Oh, come on. He's avoiding the problem. Let's catch up and see how it goes. Is he just. Does... Seems like Taylor's is quite understanding of him, though. Dead gum, Wubba Boo! Others might play games with you, but I ain't playing. I'm putting my life on the line here. But if you don't even have the guts to do the same, then what are you here for? Come on. Look down the barrel of my gun. Walk over here and take a swing at me. You got the guts. Luca, come on. Get over here and take a swing at me. You got the guts. Uh, speak up. Bring it on, Boot Hill. I'll make you eat your own words. <laughs> <laughs> Screw up a boo! You got some guts. Bullets don't have eyes, so don't blame me for being ruthless. <sighs> I thought your defeat was graceful. Not everyone has the guts to charge at a loaded gun and land a punch. <laughs> what else could I do? Turn around and leave. Accept defeat. How is that any different than taking a desperate stand? No matter what I chose, my life wasn't in my own hands. Don't you get it? If he wanted me dead, I wouldn't have had the chance to even muster an ounce of resistance. In short, it was Mr. Boothill. Who spared my life? I hate this feeling. It makes me feel powerless. Like my life is within the palm of their hand. Like all my efforts to fight back seem like a. like a joke. That girl, Margie, when she. confronted the demons of her sickness, she must have felt this way too. Is there anything in this world that isn't in the palm of the universe? <laughs> Even our Heliobi ancestors were trapped in the furnace. Even the eons must walk the path. Freedom? <laughs> Is freedom really that important? You don't get it, Mr. Tail. I just don't want to lose. Why'd he run off again? <sighs> Forget it. We're almost in the depths of his inner world. The nightmare causing his loss of faith should be hiding there. All right. Let's get this done with them. Run! 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 Run, Run you, you fool! You can't, can't win. win! You'll, You'll die. die! Run, Run away. away! Quickly! quickly. Flee! Flee. You can't, you can't win. win. Run, Run back, back to Gala. The, the skill gap, gap is too, too much. much. You'll die. die. You're still, still thinking, thinking of bringing of glory, glory back home? home? To have your name they insulted? Dream, dream on. on. You, you absolutely, absolutely can't, can't win. win. Run. Run. Are you not, not afraid, afraid of death? death? Hey, you pieces of trash. Stop spewing nonsense here. Scram. Who are, Who are you? You don't belong here. You should not be here. You are in 
Invaders. One invader. Invaders must be purged. Uh, you're kidding. You're trying to get rid of me? Oh, this is outrageous. <laughs> A part of an old party? Yes. Dangerous thoughts. Harmony and unison. Show me what you can do. I'll give you five seconds. The fearless knows not fear. Uh. Easy, Numbi. <laughs> that won't do. The market is unprepared. Right. Investing in victory means playing the ball. I venture forth to hunt forever. Triumphant! Victory is inevitable! Time to cleanse the filth. Uh... Never hesitate! No! <laughs> kind of <tip. laughs> Allow me to purge the root of the yeah. Fangs and claws got dull. I venture Eating forth up. to hunt forever. Triumphant! Victory is inevitable. Goodbye. Luca, I've cleared out that noise messing with your head. You better get it together. Noise? Mr. Jepard, uh, an officer in Bellabok. He said something like that, too. A person's inner voices make far too much noise, especially so during safe and quiet moments. Ironically, the voices that truly matter often become audible only in moments of pain, discomfort, and peril. When I was staring down the barrel of Boot Hill's gun, I realized Mr. Depart was right. My inner heart was at peace. There was only one sound that was yelling nonstop. It got louder and louder until it just overwhelmed everything around me. Run, run, run away quickly. You'll die if you don't. That was the truest voice in my heart when I stared danger in the face. <laughs> I guess it means I'm not as strong as I thought I was. <laughs> Your inner voice told you to run. So, uh, why did you still charge towards him? Because there was another weaker voice. So weak that I could barely hear it. But it still managed to reach my ears. It said, If you run now, you might as well just die here. So you did well. You charged forth. But I lost, Mr. Tail. I listened to that very important voice, and I lost terribly. Even if I were to but be he didn't revived, die. I would still lose. If not today, then tomorrow. <sighs> no matter how strong I become, I would still eventually lose. <laughs> Oh, my sides! You're killing me here! You're a real comedian! Isn't that just common sense? You humans are very fragile. Heliobi are too, of course, but uh, that's not the point. The point is... Life is a fight in a ring you're bound to lose. Aging, uh, disease, unattainable desires... Each one will knock you out. 
death just lands the final blow, making your friends and family cry. And uh, if, if there's nothing but a path of complete and utter defeat to walk, for the photo, baby bed. what exactly can be considered winning? Fool! What's the point of asking someone else this question? Huh? Isn't that something that only you can define? I... don't understand. You might as well be a single-cell organism. Let me ask you a question, and answer it properly. That young fan of yours, Margie, she fought with her illness her entire life, and she didn't make it through in the end. Tell me, did she lose? Huh. She did? Huh? But she tried her best in everything she did. She was always putting up a fight against her sickness. One punch after the next, she was the greatest boxer there ever was. In my heart, Margie won. And she won in style. See? You fully understand, don't you? <laughs> there are rules to victory and defeat in the ring. But with our lives, only we get to dictate the rules. Luca, the most important thing is to always throw the next punch. Most Always throw the next punch. Thank you, Mr. Tail. Oh, oh stop! Stop! Stop it! Oh, <laughs> I can't stand people's gratitude. Oh. Oh. Now that you've gotten yourself together, it's time to give it your all in your repechage. That's too rude. Miss Carmela, coach, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have given up so easily. Luca, what's with you? You got a bit more steam now. I've decided to participate in the popularity revival repechage and return to the war dance's stage. That's great! Luca, you finally come around! Mm hmm Took him long enough. Huh, that's fantastic! I was sad seeing you so depressed just now. Oh, you're such a brutal coach. <laughs> Duh. But what happened just now? Luca just came to his senses after that green flash of light. This treatment is a little too... effective, isn't it? <laughs> it also Maybe comes it's lot because of, I've uh, seen too many dangerous. bizarre things after arriving on the Lofu, but after witnessing Mr. Tail's capability, I'm actually surprised that I'm not very surprised at all. Hey, who are you calling a bizarre thing? <laughs> Speaking of which, doesn't the popularity revival repechage rely on popularity votes? Is Mr. Luca qualified to join the Repishosh? Let's see. Let's see. Uh... Huh. I found it. Luca, the list, the Repishosh, he's in it. Kid, looks like you're going to be busy. A pity. I'll have to temporarily shelve my plan to have Wahwa get pummeled. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Wahwa. Come on, Mr. <gasps> Tails. Mr. I'm out. <laughs> oh, <okay>. Wow. <laughs> Goodbye. He is so mean as Please come see my match again next time. I won't disappoint you after all the help you've given me. <sighs> Tess can be really mean. Ooh, Argenti will be the next ringmaster. 
Interesting. Okay, this is far enough. Go back and take care of your business. Oh, it's suffocating trying to keep a secret. I have to spill the beans. Mr. Tail actually came to look for you, too. You dare! <laughs> <laughs> uh, forget it. I'll deal with you when we get back. Anyway, you heard it. You better be a good coach and make sure that kid wins a few matches in style. Got it? I'm trying to be serious with you. <sighs> We're leaving. I'll see you some other time. Popularity Revival Repishage! Ho Ho and Tail have gone home. I should also head back to the lounge to prepare for the Repishage. Hmm. 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 Just had to close the door for a moment. Um, yeah, we can Thanks, see here where this goes next. Uh, yep. Wait, no, that's not what I wanted. Since I've been given the chance to participate in the repechage, I have to make the most of it and not disappoint everyone who's been cheering me on. With a dedicated coach like you, of course I'm gonna win. But I'm still not quite clear. What are the rules for this popularity revival match? According to the previous war dances, the repishage is a free-for-all among popular contestants that have been eliminated. There's only one winner, and only the winner can rejoin the knockout stage. But General hmm. Jing Yuan has amended the rules, hoping to give more opportunities for the contestants to showcase the beauty of duels. It is said that the La Fu has invited a highly reputable warrior known for his virtue to serve <laughs> as the referee for the repechage. Have you guys heard of the Knight of yeah, Beauty? Yeah, a lot of him. Oh, the Astral Express is so well connected. I've run into so many friends of yours already while participating in the war dance. Mr. Luca, I'm sure the knight will see the beauty in your powerful punches. I truly hope you win. <laughs> uh, thanks, Miss Carmella. I will succeed. That Hopefully. way I won't have to worry about getting a permanent role anymore. <laughs> <laughs> you get a shortcut. Alright. Are there no knockout matches actually for this one? <sighs> Do I look impressive when I punch? Uh, it's not like I can see myself in action. Will I impress the Knight of Beauty? The Knights of Beauty sounds like an organization with high aesthetic standards. There's only one remaining though. <sighs> Don't overthink, Luca. Think about Margie, and always focus on your next punch! Are you ready to showcase your style? I'm all set! Oh, yeah. I'm gonna win this! No doubt about that! Are you actually fighting, Agenda? Okay. Who summons? Okay. 
After carry consecutive use, Ultimus three times activates Bray Piston. Here's a set amount of wind damage. Aww. Follow up style team. Sure, you can work with these characters. Uh, where's my agenda? Contestant to challenge our dead team, the Knight of Beauty is a super popular young hero, Luca Stronger! Luca, the entire cosmos has been waiting for your return. <laughs> we all love you. Good to see you again, dear friend. Your demeanor is still as captivating as ever. <laughs> okay. As much as I want to keep chatting with you, dear friend, please forgive me for not giving you as much attention today. You're not the star of the day. It's Luca. Um, it's a pleasure to meet you, Mr. Argenti. I've heard a lot about you. Oh, they say you're really great. I'm pretty good myself, too. <laughs> this isn't my first time seeing you. I was there when you had the duel with Boot Hill. Mr. Argenti, I'm sorry you had to see that spectacle. But please, don't underestimate me because of that. No, not at all. When you stepped forward and swung your fist at a formidable opponent fearlessly, the beauty of that moment struck me. I've been replaying it in my mind for some time. All right. It always brings tears to my eyes. <clears throat> I guess you already got his sympathy at least. I lost so badly. It didn't really seem beautiful at all. I must correct you, Luca. Adrilla never promotes the twisted notion of winners being more beautiful than losers. Boothill was only trying to scare you, but you weren't aware of that at the time. You thought you were dying, but for the sake of your dignity, honor, and home, you stood firm and threw a punch. In my view, that's combat aesthetics at its finest. However, even though I hold you in high regard, we still have to compete according to the rules of the war dance. No problem. I won't disappoint you, Mr. Argenti. Let's go then. Well, let the trial begin. Luca, prepare yourself. Look at the IP. Hmm. I always deliver. Mr. You're invited to perform the Rondo of Beauty with me. Let's play for a while. Mm. The beauty is eternal. I will protect all beauty. For a driller. Please take this seriously, Luca. The opponent strikes again. How could we go the answer? Bending the rule. We? There's no backing up now. For me or you. The flesh wound. You're going to a bit of damage. Or devil. I'll crush them all. Until I, I will protect all beauty. The flesh will. Luca, change your angle and punch. 
We have a deal. There's no backing out now for me or you. Sergeant, think of these moves. I see. I will protect all beauty. The flesh for a drill. Right. It's to the chapel. Luca blows up another bear with his bad hands. What a man. Oh dear. Let's play. Can you find the answer? We. I should prefer to be here now before I go into the next place. Uh, Till I I will protect all beauty. For a driller. What an exciting match. Next. The beauty is eternal. Who's the little back Rise to the chapel. This is little new. You're in fight for the pose. An anthem. A beauty with me. Lord is coming in hot. Hang in there, Luca. Mmm. Silly. Wretched and free. <laughs> I will protect all beauty. The flesh will. Self-inflicted misery. Um. I'm giving you one last chance. Please, do your best. Until I, I will be soon to be struggling to land a counter. This is what we're going to do. Hmm, never ready to hear. My gratitude Let's is yours. Let's play for a while. Don't move. Can you find the answer? Rise to the challenge. The beauty is eternal. I will protect all beauty. Time for a lesson. We? There's no backing out now. For me or you. Is there a genti? Is Hunt Cat kind of the beauty? The indomitable Luca never gives up. Stop fighting, Zinor Devil. Rise to the challenge. I always deliver. You're fighting. Getting so much of his Put stuff, but. <laughs> He's barely taking any of them. Until I so see, I will protect all beauty. <laughs> My oath is to a solitary There's road. No power left to and <laughs> Until I, I will protect all beauty. Bending the rule. No doubt about it. Uh, then let's go. Back. Luca, it's a real deal. Have a deal. Luca, oh, it's a real deal. Keep your cool, Luca. Let Argenti see your bravest side. Ah, I was still mad. Till I, I will protect all the beauty. For a driller. That's amazing, Luca. I also figured the high up oh, that I was a bit confused. I wasn't wrong about you. Your skills, wisdom, and courage embody the beauty of a martial artist. Argenti oh. sees beauty in Luca. That means. Luca's strong arm is set to make a comeback to the war dance! Where are the Luca fans? Let me hear you holler! Three, two, one, mix it! 
some noise! Mr. Argenti, I'm truly grateful for your recognition. Actually, I'm simply using the authority granted by the Sienjo people to let you return to the tournament. You don't need my recognition at all, or anyone else's. <laughs> it's hard to understand your words when they sound so philosophical. <laughs> no matter. Just remember one thing. You're already the embodiment of the beauty of battle, which is a fact. Regardless of winning and losing, or what others may say, it can't be taken away from you. Now, keep that in mind, and try to digest its meaning when I'm back home. <laughs> By the way, I heard there's another war dance contestant who's good at using an iron arm. If you two are matched as opponents, it will surely be a magnificent dance. Who is he talking about? Another strong arm? Who could that be? Uh, I shall take my leave, Mr. Luca. Mm -hmm. I gotta do press conference stuff again. Hmm. Headboards in this chat today, Jesus. I'm just ready to hear one answer we had there. The one answer option, but hey, that's fine. Love for Sports Illustrated. Back to the arena, Lucas Storm exemplifies the beauty of combat. The Swiper Church was more like a dance than a battle. Contestant Luca and Mr. Argenti used combat as a medium to deliver a visually stunning feast for the audience. The clash between the Iron Fist and the Silver Lands was also a clash between conviction and beauty. Contestant Luca ultimately won Mr. Argenti's approval and officially returned to the War Dance Arena. Only Contestant Luca says this week on fire. Shop is the martial art where Luca in the martial arts as community. So another batch of documents. All right, you're on the way. This Chinchu has restored more parts of the record. Let's check them out now. Hopefully, we'll find out the reason why Igor came to the Xianzhu. I don't think I would actually save it for the next stream mm -hmm. because I will be ending the stream here for the day. So I can actually eat dinner soon. <laughs> Let's just check what we got for us, like rewards from all of this. You should go have gotten some Eidolons for from March. Oh, finally, 
some recognition for training my butt off. Got a new mission update, of course. Uh, faster where we will do some other time. See what we can get from this. Mm, there's some rules I can pick up from here. There's, there's no weapon. Ah, it's the old ones. Alright. Uh, in tactic stuff here. And do we actually get. Oh, you get another idol on at level 12, which I reached. Sweet. We got all of that. And my march is actually done with this. Music's march, finally. <sighs> finally! Some recognition for training my butt off! Ooh, ooh. Actually, not bad. Actually, not a bad of a buffer. Let's check if we can give more stuff to Ninja. Pour it off. Still not full level yet, sadly. We can do this. Finish up the light cannon. And we can boost a bit more of this stuff. Yeah. Uh, do it. Whatever's alright, I guess. Uh, okay, I can get that. Then. I shall have a level here. Speed! Speed! Alright then. Let's see. Do we have someone who can raid online? Hmm. Yep, our most favorite vampire is online. Then let's go for that. <laughs> so hearing Numpy brave in like this lowly is weird. Oh no, it's not Numpy, it's uh The Tusk over here. <laughs> the snoring is quite loud in my headphones. So Right. <laughs> All right. With that, I hope you enjoyed it. We'll be hopefully finishing up this one in another stream. And also, when we start the other event, if it's relevant with like story stuff or not. And that, hope you enjoyed it for today. As always, support and feedback is always appreciated. Okay. <laughs> and we'll see each other <laughs> next stream. <sighs> but for now, I for the Euro being nice or in the raid, give the vampire some love. She's going through all sorts of trouble lately, so. Always be kinder. And with that. We will be seeing each other next time. Until then, and bye bye.